Saving money is one thing. Specifically planning for the future is another. Most of us have some concept in mind of what a responsible financial outlook is. Of all the financial personality types, the strategist money me is the greatest example of what a mindful and responsible financial planner looks like. Mix two parts weighted consideration with one part overthinking every decision and purchase, and you have the focused, goal-driven strategist. The strategist is amazing at a few key aspects of money management. These people are detail-oriented. Every good plan is made up of carefully considered details, and they get plenty of those. Strategists are great at avoiding risks, especially those that the average person might not catch before it's too late. All that time that they spend planning out the future, it creates great opportunities to catch problems well before they have a chance to materialize. Then finally, strategists are perpetually goal-driven. The pursuit of a secure and greater tomorrow is the core motivation for all that dedication and planning. Now, I won't harp too long on their negative traits, but the strategist's meticulous nature, it does create a few rough spots. The first of which, they are very inflexible. Their core reaction tends to be something to the effect of, what's the point of a plan if we're not gonna to stick to it? This inflexibility can be a source of friction for their partners, whether it's in business or romance. Now, number two on the list of weak points is their susceptibility to high stress levels and possibly analysis paralysis. When your mind meets everything planned and in order, more complex situations aren't fun. Because of this, the strategist might benefit from learning to go with the flow from time to time. Finally, strategists might miss out on smaller wins and opportunities if they put too much weight on planning and waiting for bigger payouts or excursions. If the budget's completely tied up for next year's vacation, you might not have anything left for a spur of the moment date night or a shopping trip. Now, after hearing all that, if you're thinking to yourself, that's definitely me, or at least someone you know is a strategist, the biggest thing to keep in mind is that everything is balance. All the plans, charts, spreadsheets, and itineraries on earth, they are useful, but so is being spontaneous from time to time. If you or someone you know is a strategist money me, please tell me about it in the comments. I'd love to know what sort of life lessons or best practices you've picked up over the years to be super successful or to find better balance for you and your family. And of course, liking this video and subscribing to my channel does a lot to support my work. This Money Me Financial Personality Type Theory, it's a substantial undertaking. And in time, I hope that it helps people better understand their money management by better understanding themselves. See you next time.